you know, now for those of you that are religiously inclined, um, uh, 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 sometimes people say that Ma Tuesday also is the most productive day of the yeah, year, the week, uh, yeah, week yeah. Yeah, of, the, of the of the week, uh, you know, day of the week, mm -hmm. and. We have that thing that whenever it's Monday or Tuesday, we do the serious stuff, you know. Uh -huh. Then when it gets to, you know, Wednesday, weekend, we'll just chill around. Mm -hmm. Exactly, you know. Even as much as um, people are involved in science, science also believes that, you know, because it's the brain, so you want to do your very serious stuff earlier on during the week, and then yeah. later on the week, you can let it pass. Yeah. You see? And then, so for those of you who are religious, you feel that we, there's a saying that as God is, so are we. You know, we're made in the image and likeness of God. You know, I know uh, where this is getting to. I'm not, I know. Let's, let's go. <laughs> okay, Lance, you know, but Lance. then, uh, so, so that means that maybe God also, <laughs> God also did some creation. Maybe on Monday and Tuesday, God was serious, and then on Thursday and Friday, God was like, oh, oh God, God, what's up? Anything that happened for me, it just happened, Jerry. So uh, this one was, this one says, after so having the guest we have today, looks like he was created before Monday. You know that after Sunday, when you want to be over, over serious, when you want to prepare yeah, for exactly. Monday, so you make you know, everything perfect. So you know the creation one, I don't know. This has to be a Monday creation, Monday walk, Monday morning. You know that kind of walk. But how, how do you get to be like this? Is it your? Is it by your power or by your might or is it God? No, no. Not no. God. It's God. It's obviously God. <laughs> uh, Nobody else. After all this petty talk, now you want to find out who we're talking about? Today. Well, we have MBGN model of the year 2014 Ooh. precious john in the house Yay. wow wow not that long introduction believe me ah. i'm sure you're like where is no, it in what day what day of the week were you born june, um june june what day third the third yeah i don't Monday know the day i don't <laughs> know i don't know I, I you can find out just tell me if, if you really? tell me the year i can find out the, the day uh, how? And I, I just tell me, yeah, I'll just check the calendar. Seriously? You know, just tell me personal. So I'll just. <laughs> <laughs> He's just trying to know. I caught it this time. I'm <laughs> gonna ask my mom. I have to really know whether it's Sunday. So. Okay. Oh, 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 okay. Whoa, whoa, great, great. Well, um, how do you? Uh, okay, let me. Let's. How do you get to keep yourself like this? Because um, that is, there's no light, there's fuel scarcity, <laughs> the sun is not in your house. Oh my god. Does it, it, does it, does it, does it? Uh, eh? No, it I does. Uh, some, some people are uh, <laughs> just extra big at all the time. How do you get to be like this? Um, there is nothing really no special. Secret. Yeah, it's just God. It I beg, I beg, I beg. It's natural. If it's that's why let's come to interview. It's natural. Again but now. then again, you have to take care of yourself as a lady. Mm -hmm. You have to look good. Yeah, you know. Know. yeah. So people spend extra time taking care of themselves. No, I don't really spend really. extra time. I'm not really. I'm a model, of course. I have to take care of myself. Eat fruits, drink plenty water. Mm. Normal, the more things you always hear. Wow. It's but naturally, it's drink fruits. plenty water. Drink I think I'll start. Yeah, yeah. I know some people don't eat fruit no i eat food of course okay. who doesn't eat food <laughs> less than the normal um, yes yes i don't eat that much and but i eat more fruits like a lot of fruits okay you know it reminds me of a situation my brother's wife is just like you and she doesn't really bother about food she just uh, your brother she's just she's, she's just, just there. Yeah. yeah, and she. Are you she sure that guy could, could can see like that? <laughs> yeah, can see road. She, she, she did did she say the brother or the brother's wife? The brother's wife. wife. Okay, do, brother's do, wife. Do, 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 do you get worried like, oh, I have to? But I think it's a natural endowment for me. Yeah, it's a natural endowment. Yes. So if you eat normally, you can still look this great. Yeah, I, I don't think I can eat normally because I've trained myself like that. Wow. I can, like, I already have the amount of food I can finish. Wait, we need to train ourselves. You know, um, okay, you know, you know what happened? Something. Um, there was this kind of, um, there was this ruckus about um, some models mm. in... Uh, starving themselves. Yeah, starving themselves. And they were, they were forced and, to. Uh -huh. you know, but then before we talk about that, the phone lines are open. You can call in and talk to Precious John. 08091 Now, you see, they were forced to, by the, by the management of the pageant, to eat at the barest minimum. Lean. Very, you know, so, so now there's this anorexic uh, uh, stigma. It creates yeah. around. Everybody wants to be so skinny tiny. and tiny. Have you ever been pressured not to eat to maintain your 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 shape? One thing, what what I would say about that not eating part, where they ask models not to eat, is initially when models start modeling, if you don't, if you're not really a model, you don't have that body. Maybe you're size ten, you want to go down to size six or size four, or size, or size zero, and size six. Ooh, big or small? Small. Small. Wow. Yes. You want to go down, really down. To <laughs> I remember initially when I started, I was size eight, and then wow. I, I had 
uh, little issues with designers here and there and they wanted me to lose fat, uh, some fat in the right places so I had to like watch what I eat I started doing stop late night food uh, once it's seven I do more fruits so or light very light food and then yeah models do that models stab themselves some eat and throw up but that's wow. when you don't know what you have to do. You eat and throw up, do you, uh, do you force Yeah, they force with? themselves to throw up. So yes. what's the uh, essence of eating in the first place? Yeah, because exactly, it's because it's most difficult. of them have to put something in in order to just make the system work and then they take some out. You know, I, 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 can, I, can, nice. I can understand with, uh, what you're saying because I know there are guys that do also, they drink and then they drink they and, drink and, drink and then they force so them to throw up yes. and then go back yes. to so go and drink not again. As they yes, can. yes. <laughs> so um, the thing is knowing how to do it, how to work and do lots of exercise if you want to lose weight. Mm. You can do lots of exercise and still eat the amount of food you eat because while, while you're working out, you're burning it out. Oh, so okay. if you eat a good food, Take more fruits and water. Mm -hmm. I mean, everything. If you are meant to be a model, it's mm -hmm. going to come there. But if you're not meant to, forget it. So, hey. what was it like growing up looking like this? <laughs> I can imagine you as a small child and everybody. Mm -hmm. oh, she and she's confirmed queen. though. She, she didn't bleach. Look at her knuckles. Yeah, knuckles. Oh, <laughs> Look not at the knees. You don't, you don't have to stress about knuckles. Look at the knees. Look at now. It's, it's not confirmed. It's not a. Uh, let me not call the name now. <laughs> no, no, no comment. Let me no just comments. call the name now. But this is this is confirmed. So this what, is. what was it like growing up in your in your environment? Was everyone like, oh, you have to do modeling because you look this way, or was it a personal decision that okay, you know what? I think I should try this out. Yeah. Well, what happened? How did how did you get in modeling? Um, growing up, I was this child that likes TV, likes uh, being in forefront of everything in wow. school. I Always want to be in the front of cultural any dance. event. Yes, cultural Ooh. dance, you know. Acting, everything in school. When I was in primary school, like when I was in primary three, I, I have to be in a play primary six, primary five people are doing wow. because I know what I'm doing. I'm always, I always want to be there. I always do it perfectly. So. I've always been at the forefront. So my mom was actually thinking I'm going to go into acting at some wow. point because she's no, she knows I'm good with that. But growing up, at some point, I just thought, I saw people, I always watch TVs and I see supermodels like Tyra Banks, like Miss World, I watch pageants. And I love what they do. I like the way they strut on runways, wear heels. And I was really tall. My mom didn't like buying heels for me because she said, oh, you're tall. You Once you like? wear, I'm six feet tall. Wow, on the dot. Yes. Without heels. Yeah, without heels. She's so, six feet tall with uh, tall Continue, continue, continue now. <laughs> continue now. Uh, how tall are you? 5'11"? <laughs> 5'12"? Some people tell you 5'12". What? That's what's funny. There is nothing like 5'12". You said, I'm 5'13". <laughs> <laughs> Just imagine. That's what guys say all the time. <laughs> go, ahead, okay, go, ahead. go ahead. So, so I, I, I loved TV and everything that has to do with fashion and, and people, girls looking beautiful. So... At some point, I just thought, let me try it. I went to, I didn't even think about it. I went to just take a normal photography picture. And the guy was like, are you a model? Because you've been giving me model poses. I said, no, I'm not, but I'd love to be. And he said, oh, OK, I know some agencies I can help you get. I said, OK, no problem. So he asked me to come back like the next week. And I went to my tour everybody. Everybody was like, just go and rest. Mm. I was like, you guys don't know. It might be true. They said, I said, rest. There is nothing like. But I kept on pushing. I called the guy the next day and I, I kept on disturbing him and he was a busy guy. So I think two weeks later I said, okay, come, there's an agency open, I can take you there. And when we got there, they were like, okay, you're good, but you're a little bit big, you need to lose weight. And I already see models very skinny. I was like, oh, this is what I have to do. But I was very determined. I wanted to be a model. I wanted to be on the TV. I wanted people to see because I loved clothes, fashion, colors, everything that has to do with fashion. Mm -hmm. So I, I went again and I did my photo shoots and I started working, training. And after some time, here I am. I became a model. Wow. I was just determined to be a model. Wow. If I had relaxed because my family were like, oh, forget about it. I wouldn't be here. And you might still act. In fact, you will yeah, act, you I'm can sure. Still, I definitely. might, yeah. You know, I'm, I'm sure you get gigs, yeah, like you get calls, sure. like, oh, yeah. you like How me, are you, you so sure? I'm very sure. Like, <laughs> if I come with, it, with an acting gig and I tell you, OK, I have this, would you say no? Of course, if you can pay. Yeah, that was <laughs> it. The money really matters. Okay, now let's talk about a very um, prevalent um, challenge in the modeling industry. How have mm -hmm. you been able to deal with pressure? I'm talking about 
male pressure because definitely it comes with the job you know somebody comes and says hey come on you look beautiful and then there is this sort of um, mentality people think that okay if you are in this kind of industry then that means that you're promiscuous but then how have you been able to deal with pressure from the, your from male counterparts from from um, agencies from clients who want to you know uh, how have you been able to deal with that well um, it's a natural thing as a lady you have to meet men here and there. You meet ladies. You meet people yeah, it's everywhere. Both ways, no? yeah. yeah, it's both it's ways. That's why I said, that's why I said ladies. Yeah. <laughs> Fourteen years old doesn't doesn't scare them. <laughs> yeah. Are so it doesn't scare them. <laughs> but, uh, yes. At least before now, if I saw if I saw pressures on the road now, if I see if I see Shay with me, I'll be saying, ah, Shay with me, just do okay. At least I know it's my rival. Yeah. Now. That this like, world she's now. She's working with her friend, and you're like, is that my rival? <laughs> to this world now, Boji can be my rival. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind me. Go ahead. Yeah, so it's natural accepting um, people the way they come to you, knowing how to interact with them. That's mm. the main thing. Mm. Uh, people like you naturally. Some just want to be your friend. Some mm. want to have something intimate with you. It's how you relate with them. I, I don't have to be hostile or rude to them. Mm. Mm. Listen and know what they want from you. I just want and to be natural friends with you. <laughs> of course, we can natural. be natural. We're uh, already uh, natural friends. Forget about uh, it. Natural. Yeah, so, but I, I, you know, artificial also is also good. <laughs> oh, there <laughs> No, today we are so <laughs> So how do you draw the, the line? Is it yeah, how do you line? manage do you, that pressure? You, because Somebody, it's not easy. Some people will just come at you and they'll be yes, very aggressive about it. Yes. And they're the ones that have the big box to, yeah, exactly. to invest. So how do you do you turn it to a daddy daughter situation like yeah, how do you <laughs> do you daddy zone them or you yeah how many, how many people are in your friend zone already is it cool enough millions or? like yeah, <laughs> lots lots of friends i have lots of friends of course no i mean friends and zone. you're one of them zone friends zone <laughs> you know do I, you want to formulate like, i don't know what friends zone is now i know about friends i don't know yeah. friends. <laughs> <laughs> okay so what other project are you on right now um, I'm working on a lot of things. I'm working on my new clothing line. Uh, yeah, I'm That's working awesome. on. This is yours. No, this is not mine. Oh, okay. It's just from my wardrobe. I love the design, by the way. But Thank you. Who said? <laughs> Get your perfect size to fit you. Have you ever have you ever done nude photography? Mm, no, I haven't. What would you? What offer would I give you to make you do a nude pounds. shoot? I'm a professional model. Once I tell you my price, if you can That's what I'm saying. Pay. Tell me. Give me oh, that. Give me that. Price. What's the offer? What would... You have what? to go meet my agents to tell yeah. you that. Ah, uh, okay. If I, if I wanted to offer you 500k for just... I'm just giving you. Would you say yes? No, that's too small. Ah! <laughs> big Five enough, million. Five million. Five million. You're getting there. I'm getting there. <laughs> Five million. Wow. 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 How much is million? 20,000. For what? You know. Uh, no, no, I don't have She has a, no. an agent and a management and all that. Okay, but, then, but, but uh, you've never tried it before? I've never done it before. No, okay, no, okay even at... for a, a just cause profile, your hand. Yeah, of course, when you're doing profile pictures, you might you put something bed, under. Oh, okay. You, you have to wear something under. Just, don't just go nude. You have that feeling that if you're not yet done nude, you're not yet done full. Yeah, you're, you're, not, you're, you're not professional. Like, I'm not done full. I, I'm at the higher level. You. I'm, I see you, and I think of Naomi Campbell. That's, mm. a, that's the first, of course, a, a fairer version of Naomi Campbell comes to mind, mm. you know. But then they feel that every model or people feel that you have to, should have do nude at one point. Do you mm. feel that kind of pressure? You know what? Well, no, Mikambo didn't start with doing nude. Of course not. She started somewhere. Mm. And at a point, she had offers to do nude. Okay. And the offers came with a lot of money hmm. that can sustain her. So you don't just go do nude and nobody uses it. It's going to be trash, especially mm. when you're not up mm. there. Mm. And so then, you yeah, have we don't, to get we don't see her finish now. So yes, yeah, exactly. So what else do you want to see? Eh? Oh, oh, it has great. to be for a just cause. Yes, kind of exactly. Cause is the cause exactly. is money. <laughs> <laughs> just cause. cause. If I, okay, so if I tell you, okay. come out and see, I'll Money is enough just cause. What are you saying? Your head oh is there. No, I'm part of it. No, no, when you're saying just cause, you know what's in your mind? Precious is She's thinking of all this, no cancer. HIV. HIV. But money is also, you're off of course, money has depends. to be part of yeah, it. Money has to be part okay, of okay. So, <laughs> Precious, um, I'm looking at this trend where a lot of people, models, designers, actors, everybody wants to do something apart from what they do. Like, oh, I'm a model, but I want to have a clothing line because. Mm -hmm. So, what was your reason? So, and what do you plan to do? What, where yeah, do you plan future, to take looking up from now. the um, clothing line to? Okay. Um, 
I can model forever, like you know. Forget mm -hmm. Naomi Campbell is there and she's still doing it. Mm -hmm. I'll get to that stage where I'm there and I'm still doing it. Mm -hmm. but, but I thought now, modeling doesn't cop every day. It's not every day I get to get a job and exactly. shoot and be in front of camera. So I was thinking, if I'm not shooting today, I have to do something else. Good. So I decided to go into um, designing, Making, I might not actually be the one making them, sewing them, but I'm, um, yes, yes, idea. exactly. I'm the one behind it, creating the ideas mm -hmm. and everything. So, I also just completed a course with Nigerian Broadcast Academy. Ooh, so, nice. I'm going to go into hosting of events, TV mm. events. Do you do, you do male clothes? Can you design male clothes? For now, I'm not, but okay, I'm. Okay, but you can use me and learn, you know, just to yeah, of course, of course. Take, Once okay, we're so done, I'll take your measure. Oh, great, great. <laughs> it's okay. That's, that's, that's okay, that's okay. That's okay. You should have said that. In, thank in, you, in, thank you. Really uh, precious, uh, by the way, it's Anna. a male tailor. You, you'll be surprised. <laughs> Madam, hold on. She's okay. I want her to take my measurement. <laughs> only yes, me. for this, yes, only her to take the measurement. Okay. Thank okay, you very much. How do people get in touch with you? Social media and all that. Keep up to date with you. Yes, um, my Instagram, precious underscore John. Um, my email address, johnprecious22 at gmail.com. Um, my Twitter, pinket underscore. And you can get me. Once you get my Instagram, every other thing is there. Okay, yeah. the fashion too is part of it. Yes, yes. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much for turning up. You look, look lovely. Thank you. It's been great. Thank you. You too. Okay, oh, uh, it's been three, a very three. <laughs> three. It's been a wonderful you show. You too. I mean, thank you very much for being a part of the show. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. -bye.